Hello Taurus and welcome to your weekly reading. This is a quick and gentle reading for the week of August 8th. All right, let's take a look here. The coffee cups should be resuming um, next week. Okay, so we have some expansion. This is sometimes karmic justice, but they're ultimatums at times and it can indicate court or official agreements. Okay, so that we are seeing. Yes, you still have some kind of um, a little bit of a rough road ahead. Don't pre-assume anything. Not everything is as it seems, or you could be wrong, meaning, you know, don't assume things or things not, don't always turn out the way you thought they'll be. Um, that That's another energy I'm seeing here. We're seeing here the tower of self-worth, um, money, income, um, health, spirituality. Yes, there's some frustration. We have a new beginning here with finances too. Beautiful spiritual energy here, a spiritual person coming through. This is blessings as well, okay? Love, compassion. There's a focus on home. Um, yeah, and high creativity. There is an energy here of progress is being made. There could be some settlements and negotiations or something official going on this week, whether this is interviews, whether this is um, money settlements with our um, contracts, agreements, leases, purchases, something like that is showing up. Um, I do feel even travel is showing up here too. There is some kind of like, I want to say, um, leaving some kind of worries or fears behind you. Um, follow your intuition. That's important here as well. There is a focus on your emotions or um, I want to say somebody comes in to kind of support or help you out as well. Very supportive person. But th then it's like, I want to say there's a little bit of negativity here. You're focusing more on emotional loss um, then on gain. That is, I'm seeing for some of you, it's a, there is a strong healing energy here as well. Um, it is important to choose wisely this week too. So you got some decisions or just making choices this week is going to be important. You have as above, so below. So this is like manifestation as well. Um, some things need to be done in a traditional way, meaning, um, you know, just say you're getting a loan, uh, you know, the, the traditional loan or the traditional way, every step. I mean, that is what I'm seeing here, too. For some of you, I also hear, see here there can be talks of marriage or commitments. So I do feel that. But definitely being able to manifest a lot your way. Okay? Um, you're not very... There, there's a sense that you're more conservative with your money or in your approach this week, too. Okay? kind of be open to receive as well because I do see that you could be a little bit like you have your mind set on something and it's important to kind of look beyond or expand your horizon so I do feel that energy as well I do feel some of you could be dealing with children this week um, I do see success in what you do this week too so I do like this you have a yes answer to anything I don't answer I, I feel there, there it's a yes to a question that someone has um, it's like the world seems to work in your favor too. You've got a whole new cycle, um, coming through. And I do feel it could be connecting with someone from the past. Not everything's turning out the way you thought it'll be though. I do feel that energy. There's also addressing self-esteem issues, high creativity, and more positivity as well, as well. Okay. So yeah, seeing that, let's pull a card for the week. You have the six of swords. Okay. This does represent movement travel, sometimes thoughts of moving. There is help around you too. Um, I do pick up, this is also a healing energy. Okay. It's like, um, healing energy, finding, um, contentment, more peaceful water, so to speak. So for some of you, this could be travel, but it is a healing energy. It also tells me, um, that you're going to be filled more with optimism and high creative, uh, uh, high creative energy. Okay. So that does look good there. All right, um, Taurus, that is your reading for the week of August 8th, and I'll catch you back next week. Have a great week. Bye for now.